Hello, hi, this is Apostle Deanna Dixon back again. Okay, so this is my title for this third video. Is Christian witchcraft is all time high right now? Are you in a relationship with Jesus Christ of Nazareth or is it a ritual? Come on, somebody, hallelujah. Let me tell you witchcraft, Hollywood witchcraft, it don't matter. It don't, I'm sorry, it don't matter. Um, all kind of witchcraft is seeping in the church. As a matter of fact, let's go here. What does the devil operate mostly? I don't think you guys understand. He doesn't operate mostly on the outside. He operates mostly on the inside. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. Because that's all he knows. God made the devil. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. He was the choir director in heaven. That's why the music industry, come on, somebody, hallelujah, which is the biggest industry in the world next to big pharma, pharmaceuticals. Hold on, let's go hand in hand. Y'all on here, man. We're going to go back all the way down to the voodoo doctors. What they used to do, they used to do dum, 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 dum. all that music, all rhythm, melodies. It's all one big witchcraft. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. And it's seeped in the church. How it seeped in the church? People, stop doing, stop, stop, okay. Stop having the foundation of God. Stop wanting to be new, new. Oh, come on, somebody. You know I like you on what I'm saying. Wanting to be new, new. What's new, new? We, we got to do things new. Um, as a matter of fact, we got to bring in this type of music so we can win the kids over. Um, we got to start dressing like this and not wear the holy robes. Um, we we got to be cool. We got to do this. Come on, somebody. All kind of gimmicks, all kind of games that's not even of God. And you're wondering why the body of Christ is in disarray. Hallelujah. But, and this is the thus said the Lord. God said, my church, I'm coming back for a holy and blameless church. Do you understand what that means? First of all, it's his church. Let's get it. Let's get that understood right now. You cannot build on another man's ministry. Jesus Christ of Nazareth was the only one that built this ministry. So all we're supposed to do is to just, hey, minister. Come on, somebody. Do our part, whatever your calling is. So you don't have a little mini kingdom like most of y'all think y'all do. So that's why it becomes a ritual. Because now you're going after the money. You're going after the fame. You're going after all this stuff. And you ain't even doing what God told you to do. As a matter of fact, let's just be real. There's the spirit of Samson and Saul that's on this earth. What am I saying? You listen to the people, Saul. Oh, come on, somebody. What am I saying? Hallelujah. Samson and Saul. Samson. Samson do what he wanted to do. As a matter of fact, he didn't even know God had left him because he was doing what he wanted to do. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So I'm going to ask you again. Is it a relationship or is it a ritual? Because if it's a ritual, then in witchcraft enters in. Let me tell you how you know you're under witchcraft. Your finances acting crazy. Your family acting crazy. You acting crazy. Oh, come on, somebody. Let me simplify what crazy is. Everything out of order. It's not just out of order. Your spirit don't feel right. Oh, come on, somebody. There's no healing in your mind. There's no peace. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. God told me to tell you is it a relationship or is it a ritual? You're supposed to wake up in the morning. God, I thank you for waking me up. You spend time with God. Let me tell you something. If you're too busy and you and you got a schedule, because some of y'all got some schedules, oh, I'm going to go ahead and be transparent. Some of you got some schedules that you're so busy. You're so busy. You're so busy until you ain't even serving God. Y'all don't hear what I'm saying. You got to make sure that you have a relationship with the Father. Come on, somebody. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. That's why I ain't been on here. You ain't been seeing me on here because I've been spending time with my father. I ain't trying to impress y'all. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. I, I don't need you to be impressed with me. Hallelujah. I just need him to. Hallelujah. Now, I'm going to still do my job. Don't get it twisted. When God said to say something, I'm going to get up on here and say it. Hallelujah. But most of y'all, y'all in a whole nother room. Y'all didn't allow the spirit of the Antichrist, come on somebody, hallelujah, to come into the church and not everybody's seeking attention. Everybody's seeking followers. Everybody want to brand themselves. Everybody want to do this. And all God want is you. Come on, come on somebody, hallelujah. All he want is you. Let me tell you this thing. You cannot heal. You can't lay hands on somebody unless you are purified. The only time you can be purified is when you try. The only time you can be tried is when you're spending time with Jesus so he can get to know you and you get to know him. Hallelujah. Well, a lot of you don't even know God. I'm not saying you don't love God, but you don't know God because you don't know how to operate. Let me tell you something. Y'all prayers, you could tell by the way people pray. If you can't pray, then you don't have no relationship. Come on, somebody. And not just that. If you don't know how to really walk in obedience, oh, come on, somebody, consistently. We're not talking about one day you're cool, the next day you're not. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. Christian witchcraft. Then some of y'all, y'all bully people. That's not of God. If you have a bullying character, and, and let me tell you something, how y'all operate. Let me tell you what does say the Lord. Y'all come from the streets, and yes, God save us. But let me tell you how you stay saved, because a lot of people, a lot of people don't tell you. you see, we still got that stuff in us. That's why you're prone to snap or choke somebody out. Hello. 
You got to pray, God, keep that stuff out of me. God, keep that stuff down. Father God, every day, every day, God, keep me. Keep my mouth. Oh, Father God, don't let me say the wrong thing. Don't let me do the wrong thing. Why y'all think people snap? Come on, somebody, hallelujah. You are still human. As long as you are human, you ought to err. That's why you have to ask God, God, I need you to keep me. But it better be the spirit of God. But most of you don't even spend time with God. Overworked, under pain. Some of y'all trying to be famous, especially on Facebook. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. That's not how it's going to get done. God is looking for pure people in this hour so they can possess the power of God. So when they lay hands, people are healed for real. When they lay hands, people are delivered for real. But you got to do your part too. You got to be consistent. You got to walk this thing out re in reality. A lot of you, you chasing money. You, you chasing a man. You chasing a woman. You chasing this. You chasing that. That ain't going to get it. Yeah, that'll, that'll suffice your flesh for a moment. But honey, when that stuff come, what is that stuff? Life. Oh, come on, somebody. When them tests and trials come and you ain't got nothing to combat, what you going to do when it comes for you? Hallelujah. Christian witchcraft. Some of you leaders try to manipulate people. What am I saying? Well, if you don't do this, then you can't be part of this. All y'all got some clicks and tricks. Clicks and tricks. That is not of God. Come on, somebody. That's called with Christian witchcraft. Intimidate people. What about people been, oh, over the pulpit? Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Extra, what do you call it? When you exercise, exercise people, ostracize, ostracize. I'm sorry, I, I, I made up a word, exercise, but y'all know what I'm saying, ostracize. That is not of God. Let me tell you something. When you love God, you love people, even when they ugly. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. Church, you gotta tear down that stuff. I keep saying it. I keep hearing. Come back to basics. Learn how to love people to life. Learn how to treat people with respect, even when you get in an argument. Learn how to effective communicate. I'm telling you what does said the Lord. Y'all trying to win this and win that, win the world. What you going to do when it comes for you, the spirit of death? Hallelujah. Y'all don't hear what I'm saying because we all got to die. What you going to do? Where you going to spend eternity at? Because let me tell you something. Facebook can't save you. Oh, hallelujah. Faith can't save you. Hallelujah. For the spirit of God. Hallelujah. Stuff can't save you. Only the spirit of God. Tell me what does said the Lord. Hallelujah. <clears throat> so my prayer is that it be a relationship. <coughs> a real one. Not a ritual. What's a ritual? You're just doing it to do it. You go to church every Sunday, every Sunday. Do the same thing, do the same thing, do the same thing. It should be something in the inside of you that say, I don't want to sin no more. No, I'm not perfect, but I, I, I want to do better. I want to be better. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Y'all don't hear what I'm saying, do you? Kristen Witchcraft is at all time high. 